Grade 3 math number 73. One fifth. One fifth. We're going to talk about one fifth. Here we have a flower and there's five flower petals. One, two, three, four, five. See that? One of them was picked off. Poor flower. So, one is the number of petals that was picked off. Five is the total number of petals. So one-fifth of the petals were picked off. See that? One-fifth. Okay, let's look at this. We got five frogs. One, two, three, four, five. If one jumps away, then one jumped away out of five frogs total, one-fifth has jumped away. One of the five. See? Okay, let's look at this. We got 15 balloons. 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Out of these 15 balloons, three are flying away. Three fly away out of 15 balloons total. Three fifteenths have flown away. Three of the 15. Three fifteenths. That is equal to one-fifth, because three times one is three, and three times five is fifteen. One-fifth. See? Three. One three goes into fifteen five times. One over five. See? Okay, let's try another one. You got thirty jelly beans. Six of them are circled. Six of thirty of them are circled. 6 times 1 is 6. 6 times 5 is 30. Here's our 1 fifth. See it? 6. 1 of these 6's goes into 30 five times. 1 fifth are circled. See? Let's try another one. 10 blue dots. 2 are circled. 2 are circled out of 10 total. 2 tenths. 2 times 1 is 2. 2 times 5 is 10. Here's our 1 fifth. How many times can 2 go into 10? 1, 2 goes into 10 5 times. 1, 5, 1 fifth. See how that works? You can either have a whole thing split into 5 parts and take one of them to have a fifth, or you could have a bunch of things in a group and take a part of that group to have a fifth of the group. See? That is one-fifth, and equivalent fractions to one-fifth. One part of something that was split into five parts. We're going to talk about one-sixth next. See you next video.